M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Just a note here on if you're using like things like FTA and other programs interfaced with your ICOM radio, um, if we read here, the Silicon Labs USB devices are extremely susceptible to RFI when you transmit. The usual ferrite beads on the cables are not effective in preventing malfunctioning in the port. Um, and I'm uh, taking this advice from win for icom uh, which is a, a program which I'll be doing a video on as well, uh, like a, a control program. So the ferrite ring that is recommended here is the FT240-31. And I've been looking around, and they're all over, so you'll find them on eBay and Amazon. This this one seems okay price. So it's quite a big one. And then if you look at the configuration here, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, maybe nine curl, you know, nine times putting it through the hole and wrapping it around. You get the idea here. And uh, the other thing that I think is good advice is here it says turn off. USB sleep, fun sleep function. So after a period of inactivity, the USB ports by default in Windows will go into a low power state and stop functioning. It is important that you turn this off. Open the Windows control panel. So should we try this? Not really done this at all yet. Let's just put it where we can see it. And we'll follow his steps. And thanks very much again to win for sweet icon suite in this case so uh, open the control panel da, 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 and under power options so let's look for power options hardware system and security accounts appearance clock now I can't see it here so I'm gonna have to um, do that do this in a minute but it basically says click on the change plan settings, then advance, select USB settings and disable the USB selective suspend. The other place where the power management should be turned off is in the device manager. Open the ports section, find the Silicon Labs drivers, right click on them and select properties and next to power management tab and uncheck the option that allow the computer to save power. So I think I could probably do that. So right click device manager uh, go to the port and it's this one here so silicon right click properties and let's have a look now power management allow computer to turn on the device to save power there you are we'll turn that off they are unticked and then we'll click ok well that's worth knowing isn't it and so we'll work out the the other one but at least you've got the settings here have a have a read here for the first part which i'm sure is straightforward so i hope this helps um get yourself a, a ferrite a ferrite 240-31 ring and and uh, let's reduce all the rfi interference going into our our ham radio 73 all the best